There's been additional attacks on mail carriers in the Bay Area, including two in San Francisco, even as the Postal Service is ratcheting up the pressure on criminals. Our crime reporter Henry Lee is here now with the details. Henry. Christina, these mail carriers are just doing their jobs, and in doing so, they're being exposed quite literally to the criminal element. That's why postal inspectors are upping the ante when it comes to these crimes. These are the screams of a postal worker as she's confronted by robbers in San Francisco's Mission District. It happened near 26th and San Jose at about 3.30 Tuesday afternoon. The carrier was attacked by men who tried to rob her before they took off in this Infiniti G37. In another holdup, robbers in this 90s Cadillac Seville attacked and robbed a mail carrier of postal keys near 23rd and Hampshire, also in the Mission, at about 3.40 Thursday afternoon. There's definitely been uh, an increase in robberies and assaults of, of mail carriers on their jobs. Postal Inspector Matthew Norfleet says these are federal crimes that could lead to federal time. Attacking letter carriers, stealing the mail is not worth it. There are postal inspectors who are working uh, day and night to track these people down, bring them to justice. Inspectors have been making arrests. Authorities say a man robbed a mail carrier of postal keys near 23rd Avenue and East 29th Street in Oakland. He then left in this Lincoln Town car, which was also used in mail thefts in San Francisco. The car, an apparent match in this photo taken by Oakland police, who identified the suspect as Stephen Hilton, someone they had previously arrested. Inspectors say they also linked Hilton to mail theft at this high-rise apartment building at East 12th and 3rd Avenue in Oakland. Authorities say these surveillance images show Hilton stealing mail at the building while wearing a Golden State Warrior shirt. That same day, investigators say Hilton wore the same shirt while stealing mail at this apartment complex on Hanover Avenue near Lake Merritt. Kate Lewis lives nearby. I think it's our job as, as citizens and taxpayers to protect them. And it's really not fair that their jobs are so dangerous right now. Now the Postal Service is offering rewards of $150,000 for tips in any and all mail carrier robberies. That amount is triple what they have been offering until recently. Live in the studio, Henry Lee, KTVU, Fox 2 News. All right, Henry, thank you.